Hello, dear friends. Hope you're all doing well. Today's story is rocks, pebbles, and sand. So let's get started. A philosophy professor once stood up before his class with a large, empty mayonnaise jar. He filled the jar to the top with large rocks and asked his students if the jar was full. His students all agreed that the jar was indeed full. He then added small pebbles to the jar and gave the jar a bit of a shake, so that the pebbles could disperse themselves among the larger rocks. He then asked again, "Is the jar full now?" The students agreed that the jar was still full. The professor then poured sand into the jar to fill up all the remaining empty space. The students then agreed again that the jar was full. In this story, the jar represents our life, and rocks, pebbles, and sand are the things that fill up our lives. The rocks represent the most important projects and things you're going through. such as spending time with your family and maintaining proper health this means that if the pebbles and the sand were lost the jar would still be full and your life would still have meaning the pebbles represent the things in your life that matter but that you could live without the pebbles are certainly things that give your life meaning such as your job house hobbies and friendships but they are not critical for you to have a meaningful life these things often come and go and are not permanent or essential to your overall well-being finally the sand represents the remaining filler things in your life and material possessions this could be small things such as watching television browsing through your favorite social media site or running errands These things don't mean much to your life as a whole and are likely only done to waste time or get small tasks accomplished. The metaphor here is that if you start with putting sand into the jar, you will not have room for rocks and pebbles. This holds true with the things you let into your life. If you spend all your time on the small and insignificant things, you will run out of room for the things that are actually important in order to have a more effective and efficient life pay attention to the rocks because they are critical to your long term well being hope you like today's story see you again with another one soon